Hey everyone, I'm Risa. I'm the social jockey for Calliope Games and welcome back to Aw Shucks 2021. If you're uh, just joining us, we're playing Mass Transit, which is Calliope Games' very first cooperative game. And it plays from one to six players. If you've been watching us throughout the weekend, you've seen me play the game solo. And now we're gonna try to really push the limits of the game with a six player version when we have uh, almost the entire team at Calliope Games here to play with us, uh, and also the designers of Mass Transit. So we have Kevin Rogers, one of the designers. Yay, and, go. <laughs> and we have Chris Leader, who is a designer and also the director of fun at Calliope Games. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining us. With us, we also have Ray Weirs, the president of Calliope Games. Welcome, welcome. We have Andy Hepworth, the art director. Hello, everybody. And Ken Franklin, our senior yeoman. I'm ready to commute. <laughs> <laughs> so before we get started, let's talk just a little bit about Mass Transit, uh, the game, how it was designed, who developed it, and how you two wound up working together. So Chris, if you want to get started. Sure, yeah. Um, so I have uh, always been a fan of cooperative games. and. Um, I had played games like The Game and The Mind um, that were limited communication and they were fun, but they didn't hit the table all that often. And I thought, you know, a little bit of theme might go a long way here. So um, I started tinkering with this idea of uh, commuters getting home after a long day and uh, working in a big city. And the transit routes made a lot of sense because it was, uh, you know, different distances between stations and things. So players would not be able to tell each other what they had and you'd have to work together as a team. So I started coming up with that idea. And once I hit my standard design brick walls where I'm like, oh boy, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do anything with this thing. Um, I called my, one of my oldest friends, Kev, and I said, uh, could, you, could you help me out here? And so he jumped aboard and, and at that point it was a little bit bigger of a game than it is right now. I'll let Kev tell about that part. Yeah, at the, uh, when I got on board, we had, uh, we had the, boats and the trains and the buses like we do now, but we also had Zeppelins that we were trying to figure out ways of getting around the city, and, uh, big old blimps and things like that. And it was a really cool idea. It just didn't work out for the game. So we started trying to scale back a little bit. And, and those, those Zeppelins, were those Zeppelins made of a heavy metal? I can't remember what kind of Zeppelin they were. They were. I think they were made of iron, iron <laughs> Zeppelin. Iron Zeppelin, that makes sense. Mm. Yeah, we had a couple communication breakdowns, and uh, <laughs> I won't make any more Led Zeppelin jokes. But um, <laughs> we we started we started scaling it back. And like Chris, I'm a huge fan of cooperative games. I love games where you know you can get down, you can get with a group and sit down at a table and focus on working together to solve a problem or you know defeat an enemy or whatever it is. Um, so the idea of doing a cooperative game is always something that's forefront with me too. So it worked out perfectly. Uh, you know, after a, a little bit of work and a little bit of scaling back and a little bit of tweaking and stuff like that, we, we broke through and, and, and we found out we had something pretty cool. And it was nice during the pandemic times to be able to work on this because it plays solo all the way up to six players. So it was something where we could test it at lower player comes very easily because we found ourselves kind of by ourselves and only with maybe one other person a lot. So the game is great solo with no rules changes. And then it can play all the way up as we can see from this very stream, um, it plays up to six players. So uh, that was a lot of fun to test and be able to play with a wide um, variety of players. Awesome. And, and it is a, a little known or well known, I'm not quite sure known fact um, that Ray, our president, is not a, a huge fan of cooperative games for one very specific reason. So Ray, how did how did Calliope wind up with its very first cooperative game? Um, well, Chris came over, you know, to my house with a phone book and a bag of quarters, threatening me. <laughs> I went to work. Straighten me out, mm -hmm. right? Um, Never <laughs> take. No, that scar is healing quite nicely, Ray. <laughs> It's the chest bruises that really get you. <laughs> but, um, no, it's in all seriousness. So uh, Mass Transit actually has everything that is a Calliope game. And so um, the thing that I don't like about cooperative games that this game actually solves 
is that uh, uh, one player who wants to dictate the game and actually tell everybody what to do on their turn and, and direct the game. And so that happens quite often with, um, with cooperative games. And because of the limited communication that is in mass transit, you know, uh, Chris and Kevin, they actually solved that issue. And I really, really like that. Um, and the, the other thing that happens with it, because it is uh, limited uh, communication, um, you are able to talk about and give clues of what's in your hand, if you will, right? But you can't tell anybody what's actually in your hand and you can't tell anybody what to do or where to go or, you know, yourself, um, you can project, right? But again, you can't actually tell somebody. And so uh, that kind of, that does greatly diminish that, that player who wants to direct the game. And, um, and so everybody in, in, that's playing is actually making the decisions on their own. And you know what? Sometimes, you know, when you're building a transit system for a, a, a community, you know, the red tape is just too thick, man. It just doesn't get done, <laughs> you know? So um, mass transit, you know, if you dig down deep, right, for Calliope, it follows all the rules. It's two to six players. It plays well within the hour. Usually it's a 20 to 30 minute game, regardless of the number of players that you have. And um, and it's going to be 15 bucks, you know? So it's, uh, it, it's, it's, and, and th three rules, right? You, you play a card, move a, a, a transit, you, 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 a, a pawn, a transit. <laughs> you move a meeple down the road, you know? So it's, it's, See, uh, it's really the easy. Scars may heal, but the mental damage from being beat up. Right. Yeah, right. I'm telling you. <laughs> well, let's do this. Let's let's go ahead and shuffle these things up. I, I say let's we try to get some of these commuters home. So let me deal out. Four cards each of us. Now let's let, hear the groans from the people who hate their cards. I do. Yeah, I hate you know. Oh, I, I really hate my cards. <laughs> I am. I don't mind my cards. System. You don't mind your cards. I mm. do not mind them. Uh, Maybe I'm pretty happy. I don't want to go first. <laughs> I do not mind them on a train. I do not mind them on a plane. <laughs> I do not mind them on a boat. <laughs> do you mind them with a goat though? Um, so in this no. in this case, anyone can volunteer to go first. Um, I will go first then. Okay. Since I don't hate my cards, and I'll start out by putting out a good old bus row here. Oh, very nice. One of the other things I really like about this game, and a lot of Calliope games, I mean, it's been a minute since any of us have been to a convention. But what I like about this game is, as you watch people play it, you can figure out how to play. Like you don't have to sit down and be explained the rules. You can watch a couple turns and go, oh, I get it. Okay, so we're going, we're, we're putting down cards. You have to stop at a station. Uh, if there is an exclamation point, you have to play that card before your turn is over. It's all Look very self you. Look at Kev over here, puts up two stations. So it's always good to get stations right outside the city so the meeples can walk to it. And he put a walk card out. So this this uh, person right here says, you know, I need to take the bus home. Ready to ready to get on the bus. Very good. All right. So Andy, did he do anything that helps you in your endeavors? I think so. Yes. Yeah. I like it. Uh, I've got to play this one. Oh, good. Yes. So, work. so that might be the least bad place for it to go. Yes, indeed. Uh, I have... I just want to let Chris know that I am well trained to play this game. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Interesting. Trained. I just hope you're not railroading me. Uh oh. Uh oh, here they come. Yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh. Okay. Wait. That's the thing. We there's nothing we can say because you have to play those cards if they have an exclamation mark to turn after you draw them. And hey, we got a lot of walking to do. Yeah, yeah. But I think he's handled that part. Okay. okay. Very good. So for for anyone who has not played the game before, uh, there's no station on this one, which means this commuter will have to walk to this card and then walk to hopefully the next card, which is a station card. Um, and we will uh, we will make that happen. It's over to me then, A. 
It is. When you get well, out of work, you, you don't have a station right outside your job. You got to walk to it. You know, I think I'm going to get this person walking. They're walking between <laughs> the things so that they're <laughs> on their way just in case. And I'm going to stop right there and take two cards. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm going to get things going here. I'm going to put the other bus route out. All right. And uh, let's see. I'm going to help Chris. You know, yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay. I also think maybe, hold on. I think I'm going to help over here. Putting some vibes out to Ken right now. Okay. What's that? You're sending some, some vibes? vibes out to would you. you like me to play another card, Risa, or would you like me to stop? I would like you to play that other card. <laughs> so, yeah, right now, right now we have two bus routes. We have one I need it train in a very route specific place. <laughs> and we have one okay. boat route. Well, um, you know, this could be good for, for water and this could be good for trains. It's the other train route we could get. It's the other station. Yeah. You know, a train station's not a bad idea. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there Let's we go. Okay. I like that. Oh, I like well, that. Well, I'm, ha I'm, I'm happy when you're happy, Risha. Thank you, kid. We're a good team. All right. <laughs> okay. Because I have a, come on now. I have an incredible oh. urgency. There we go. That I can, uh, no, not the whole thing. I just. Just the person. Just the person. You don't need to take everything. Just the person. Do you imagine if you just picked up the whole street when it was time to? I <laughs> <laughs> roll Risa up the right? out over here. Right. It is what it is. Um, and then I'm also feeling very urgent over here, but I want to avoid those traffic stops. So that's mm -hmm. not the full Risa card. It's super close. That's like yes. By the way, there is one of these cards that has all three traffic on there, and that is a really in incredibly sucky action card which is r-i-s-a and that's risa so that's the risa card <laughs> oh i'm sure that card will come out soon <laughs> give it a minute it'll it'll come out okay i um am not done i'm gonna get oh um heck yeah i started very and good then, you know what let's just do this let's get the whole thing taken care of and we're mm. gonna finish well not finish but We'll okay. continue that route. Nice. Beware right, the red it. cards out here. We need some trains to get people home. That's true. That's very true. Okay. <laughs> All right. Ray, help us out. Sure. This guy over here, since he did so much walking, I think he needs some time on the train. Oh, that's good. I that's like really that. Good. And uh, so we cap them off with uh, suburb cards. And there is one suburb, two suburb cards for each style, bus, train, and uh, ferry or boat. Um, but one of them has a three and one of them has a four uh, with them. So you are you either have to have three cards in front of it or four cards in front of it. So now that oh, one's ready to look go. Look at this. Four. Excellent. Oh, right. So now we have yeah. all of our routes started. All of our stations are out. Yeah, my. Like and I'm going to give it up right there. Good. Okay. Go, Kevin. All go. right, Kev. Go, Kevin. All go. right, let's see what we can do. I think since we, uh, we've already started building up these water routes here, let's yeah. see if we can get them There and then, since we spoke about it, why not bring out the world famous Risa? Oh. oh, it's me. Okay. And there it is. And then I'm going to be done. And of course, when a commuter moves from this spot, it would be have to use a, a boat card that's discarded to move this person along. If they stop at traffic, you have to use another boat card to move them on. You can't use a walk card from a traffic because that would basically mean the person jumped off the boat into the canal and swam. I went swimming. 
I need more. Right. 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 Too chilly of a day for that. They didn't bring a jacket. <laughs> all right. Now we're all turning expectantly toward Andy. Yes. All are. eyes on Scotland. <laughs> Don't let us down, Scotland. <laughs> it's too late for that. Uh, so. Oh, and there's our first suburb. All right. That's excellent. Okay. And I've got one more thing to do. Wait. Oh, okay. So that is me. So a hot tip for all the people viewing out there. Can you have a card? Just play one more card. Too oh, maybe, maybe this hot tip would help before you play that card. <laughs> um, you notice how there's a straight through road and a straight through rail on this blue card right here. That could be used on any of the other types of routes to not put another station along that route. Same with the, the gray card over here. So Somebody? had these been swapped, they would have actually helped that route by not adding a uh, station. So that's just a hot tip for players uh, that can help you get people home faster. But then you can, then you can be watching, you know, doing the scenic route, you know? That's right. <laughs> Could, you know, it could actually be in Seattle Chris, on the ferry, looking at all the, at the whales. You know, there are only five cards left. In the oh deck. my gosh! Okay, this game goes so fast when there's six players. Okay. All right, Andy. That's another playing? good thing about the game is it done. goes about the same amount of time no matter how many players you have. Okay, so we need to start moving along here, right? So uh, I'm going to put this out here and cap okay. off this train route, and then I'm going to play this urgent train card to get this person. Home. Nice. Right, that's one. Um, and then I will. Oh, you know, what I'm gonna do is. Ay, 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 ay. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put one of these cards out, and I'm actually gonna put it here in case someone has the four. Uh, if, uh, the four okay. cap has already been played. Not for the water. Oh, for the water. Yes, yeah. you're right. Correct. So I'm, I'm sorry. Draw three of these five cards. All right. Now I have a hypothetical here. If I drive to this station, you can walk to the next one. Then I can walk home, right? Yes, yes. that is correct. Absolutely. You just can't okay. walk from traffic. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, but you know we're short on green stuff. Two people are still in the city. We two have two people in the city. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, just so just better. so the team knows, I'm a big fan of Johnny Cash, and I walk the line. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. That's good. All right. Well, that white's already walked, and he's already walked. And I played a green, so I'm going to just have to get this guy on the road. There you go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. Okay. And um, I think he really needs... Yeah, that's good because that'll allow the the three suburb for buses to be placed. Yes. Now I will just comment that if I get another turn, mm -hmm. okay, I can I can drive us home. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. You I see, have... and and you see everybody paying attention here. You can throttle the amount of limited communication in your game <laughs> to be all the way to Ken level or down to none. Uh, Ken really oh. walks the line of that rule. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, that's the Chris level. It's one nano inch away from Ken level. All right. Well, I don't think I'm going to get another turn. Um, so... I'm going to go full stop here and I'm going to play one urgent card to drive. Now, nope. again, with the, just picking up the whole road to there. And then, oh, I had another plan. What was it? Um, this game got musical all of a sudden, right? I, you know, sometimes you just got to sing. It makes you feel a little better. The commuters right. get home tomorrow. I'm going to go ahead and empty my hand. I can do this. I have Ooh. a plan. 
I think right. of, I think of you saying that like you're He-Man pulling the sword. I have a plan. <laughs> we're gonna go all the way to the traffic and stop, and then we're gonna. Now the four's already been put out there, and that that's the four. But you know what? I can't. So I have this card, and I can't use it. Um. Well, actually, I could put it here. You could, no... Yes, you could. Is that the only card left in your hand? Yes. Okay. So here's another hot tip for players. If you wanted to, if you only had one card and you were the last player, you don't have to play two cards if you get the person home before that. That's true. Does that right. make sense? Yeah. So if Risa held on to that card and it came back to her and we were one water card away from Like winning, right here? She, yeah, she could play that card get the person home, and even though she didn't play that second card, we will have still won the game. Yes, because when you well, win, the game ends immediately. Well, it's too now late I now. Know. That's things that Risa should have known of about five minutes ago. <laughs> That's why it would have been good if I told her that five minutes ago. <laughs> Again, information that would have been important yesterday. yesterday. It, it's fine. Ray, Ray Smiley. I, I think, think we should, should have a, a a counter at the bottom to see how many pop culture references we actually make in one game of Master. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, uh, what do we need to do here? So we need. We're ready. So my to... dad, my dad, um, was in the construction business. Uh huh. And uh, you know what? I think I'm going to follow in his footsteps here. <laughs> build, build, build. Yeah, so um, I'll tell you what, in a, in a two player game, it's it's very much like, you know, you, you it's a dance with the other person to get the stuff out. When it's a six player game, you, you are looking to see how many turns it is before it gets back to you and hoping that people don't, uh, you know, cap off routes for things that you have or that it can get back to you so that you can. Yeah, well, that was my intention was make sure that there's at least three uh, cards out so that if people have suburbs, they're not trapped and have to wait until it comes around to them again. Oh boy. Oh boy. Can we do it? Yeah. Hey, uh, that is amazing. Uh, I have good feelings about this. Maybe I, I shouldn't. Do. I do. I, I feel that's very nice. Uh, Ray, how many cards do you have left? Just one? One, but I have to play it. Yeah. Oh, was it urgent? But it's all right. I've got a good place to put it because I'm in the construction business and I know how to build roads. There you go. <laughs> uh, I know you, how to build wait, roads. So you're saying you measured twice so it should only cut once, right? That's it. That's <laughs> all right. It. Woo! All, all right, right, Kev. Let's see what I can do here to help. Wait till out. you guys get the bill. <laughs> <laughs> that Great. was tremendously mm -hmm. bad. Awesome. Good. All right, so everything is capped off now. So now it's just a matter of we can, can we get people home. So let's go ahead and get this person right here. Oh, I think we're going to finish. I should say it. <laughs> and then Blaftone. Take the we'll make like the in sync movie on the line and we will take this person home as well. Oh, very good. All right, Andy. Okay, here comes Scotland <laughs> snatching, <laughs> snatching <laughs> defeat from the jaws of victory. So. <laughs> hey, all right. Good. All right. Good. We got it. We got it. Now, he it. can walk or float, right, from there. Well, if he walks, then he's got to play two more walk cards. Well, because there's another... Uh... Oh, there we go. Okay, he's got a station. Hi. Moving him along. One more. Footloose and fancy free. Another blue. The tension is... Oh, oh, right <laughs> oh my there goodness. Is. There it is. Five home, Chris. Can you do it? Andy, are you done? I think I am done now, uh, yeah. Oh. No. Oh. We are one card away. Can Chris do it? The question is, 
Do you want me to walk them or drive them? Yeah. Yes. Wow. Boom. Nice. The other cards I had were not very fun cards, but we, we officially got oh. all six commuters home. <laughs> Nicely done, everybody. Very good. Awesome. I thought I'd blown it for you. Oh, well done. <laughs> oh, no, no, we are all good. And that's the thing is like sometimes the most like optimal move like would have messed us up if we didn't have those extra stops in there. Like we might have been capped and not had. Yeah. Any or it could be yeah. that if the last stop before the city was a traffic instead of a an actual station and yeah. you didn't have right. a walk card, because sometimes those walk cards get put out early. Yeah. You know, they're done. They're gone. And so if you get stuck on, you know, uh, a station and you don't have that thing, you can't walk. So, woo, that was, that was good. Really, really great. That yes. was awesome. Congratulations, That's everybody. Now let's see if we can do it again. Now, we should, we probably should say to everyone watching that we tried to do this yesterday multiple yes. times with technical issues yeah. and we lost yes. every single every time. game. So yeah, today, by one card. That's right. Yeah. We played what, three or four games and yeah. lost every single one. <laughs> all right, everybody, we're back. We've all, uh, we got up, we did some dancing. We, uh, we had a great little break. And now we uh, want to press our luck and see if we can do this again. Six players getting six commuters home from the big city in mass transit. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. Yeah, I'm ready. ready. I just want to point out this is how Vegas wins everybody's money. <laughs> yeah, you, you like, we can do this again, right? <laughs> oh, it's so true, though. I won 20 Ooh. bucks. Let's go again. Oh, I'm down to 40. I really want Risa to go first. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. I can do that. Is that oh, because then you would go last. Yes, I think Ken wants things to develop before. I, I can do that. I can go first. Yeah, I can definitely go first. If I'm cool <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go first. Let's do it. Do it, Risa, <laughs> do it. I'm not nervous. You're nervous. Okay. <laughs> Actually, I have a very good starting hand. I am I am ready. Right, we got a bus station, we got a train station. I have nothing urgent. And oh, oh walking Ooh. people, that is a good start. That's a good start. All, All right. right, guys, let's One just call commuter out of the city. Just call that a win, I think, because it can only go downhill <laughs> right. from there. Uh -huh. Well, I do believe that. Uh, Ooh, I'm a happy man, Mr. Wears. Right here. Right. There we go. You got a bus station and a train station. You got to have a ferry in between. Right? Heck yeah. And, yep. You know, I'm I'm always um, a firm believer of uh, following the the suggestion of the designer. <laughs> okay. And uh, building the opposite sides. Yes. I kept my head on that early. I kept things neat. You know, the other thing I was thinking about um, was that when, when we first started this, Kev, you remember there were the transfer areas where you could transfer from one place yes. to another. And do you remember in the very early days, you could transfer from one route to another, like really yeah. early on. And it was mm -hmm. so, it, it, it was like, it made sense, but it was so complicated that we took that out and it made right. it for a much uh, it's more straightforward, <laughs> literally. <laughs> let's, let's get this right. out of my hand. But that is a nice little like Hail Mary when uh, when you're you're stuck with a bunch of stations or whatever dead ends, those dead end yeah. cars. Well, especially doing. in something like this where you have maybe built this to be a, a boat route and someone accidentally put this thing down here. So now you either have to walk onto another boat. There used to be a way that you could then transfer around to a different route, but then it, it got very complicated with that. But there also was a time when you had to get three commuters to each station there were a lot yeah. more meeples in the game at one point yeah. i think it was Ray right who said why let's just make it simple <laughs> right i think you're right we're like oh yeah sure okay that makes sense <laughs> yeah, all right one <laughs> definitely one of those things where you go oh oh it's a risa card yeah we got got to get this out of there right away although this is now mm. two times in a row 
I've had the Risa card, so I don't I'm know. We're gonna rename it to the Kev card. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So we got that, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play my urgent bus, and I'm gonna get him right along this stop sign, so nice. we don't have to worry about that too much. And then I'll I'll call it. That's when you like see the traffic okay. off the distance, and you're like, well, yep. no way around it. Drive right into it. Let's do it. Yep. Uh... You know, if we if we call it the Kevin card, it could be the keep everyone uh, very incredibly nervous card. That works. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, could Tish a motion to turn it into the Kevin card? Seconded. Oh, okay. There we go. Seconded. Um, folks, you know, you know, board meetings are the third Tuesday of every month. This is not a third oh, Tuesday. We already passed that. <laughs> we have to discuss I, I, that at the I next board meeting. Table it. <laughs> <laughs> We'll discuss that next the next third Tuesday. Oh boy, that's gonna take a while. We'll forget by then. That's a good railway card. Hello, Freya. Yes, I'm just wondering. That's a really good railway card. <laughs> My dog really wants to play with us. She wants to uh, help get commuters home as well. She hears that there's. I think the problem is she keeps hearing that there's walk cards, and every time she hears that, she's like, "What kind of cards now?" What kind yeah. of run cars? <laughs> the end of my turn. All right, you're done with your turn. All right. I am done. So I have got to play this card. And I'm going to play it here to continue the road. Um, and I am going to walk this person to here. Right, right. And then I'm going to stop right there because I, I want to see how things develop. Right. Well, oh. first of all, that's marvelous. Ooh. Okay. Good. okay. We have a destination for the short railway line. Yes. Okay. That's good. That's good. All right. I don't think we can say, I don't think we can say yeah. short line in board yeah. games. We'll be sued by the Monopoly people. Oh, no. Well, I think I'm going to have to do some walking. Will, will they send me to jail then? Will I need a get out of jail free card? They're going to send you directly to jail. I don't pass go. All right. There we go. I could sure use $200. Listen, Kev, you don't have a clue. Oh. <laughs> it's worth the risk. Oh, I was going to use that one. Oh, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I'm sorry, but you're in trouble. <laughs> Yeah. conversation is boggling my mind <laughs> <laughs> you know you you could go in front of a judge but with your luck you'll have to roll for it wow this, I know. Just this, it. this whole thing feels like an allegory for something i'm not sure <laughs> it's up to you risa oh i'm sorry i was distracted by the puns she was trying to think of other games to use in our conversation yeah we're all plumed. All right. Uh, well, I do not have a great hand. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I have a very bad one. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do uh, this. Nothing wrong with that. Hey, that's a nice way to play that. Yeah. That's okay. Yep. That's not bad either. So you're you're taking Eat lemons and making lemonade. That's okay. Right. Yeah, that's why the cards are yellow, by the way. What? <laughs> oh. They're the lemon cards that you have to make into lemonade. That's why the cards are yellow. You no, know, you know what? You know what? Okay, here is where we're at again. I am worried that it's not going to get back to me. I am. I have some cards that probably need to get played. <laughs> He's got play. some real trust issues because of that. <laughs> I know, right? There are eleven cards left. Yeah, there are eleven in the cards. Deck. Left. Yeah. Okay, but I'm going to play that, and I'm going to stop. The next time it's going to be before you play your first hand. I'm not sure if it's going to get back to me. Uh, Lisa, we haven't, right. shuffled, we haven't shuffled the card yet. The puzzle board hasn't been built yet. No, if it's going to be my turn again. <laughs> All right. So let's. Ray's got to move somebody. We play with the alternate. And I like I like riding on the trains. Yeah, so. Come on, ride the trains. Somebody throws out an Uno skip card. Wait, that's not in the deck. <laughs> and since I'm on the train, I think we need to. Uh, 
Let's see. Can't do that. All right, I'm going to leave it up to you guys to. Terrible oh, decision. All right. What What are you going to do with that card, Ray? Oh, sorry. Oh. No, Ray, I'm not. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, that's that that, that route card also could have been used to get this poor guy home. This guy needs to go over here. It's all right. I'll take care of him. <laughs> all right. Yeah. You know, that almost sounds threatening. Don't yep. worry. I'll take care of him. Don't <laughs> worry about it, boy. <laughs> this could be trouble, guys. <laughs> Listen. Any game can be a role playing game if you try hard enough. So, if you want to give all of these meeples little stories of getting on their way home, you go for it. You do it. <laughs> so I guess any <laughs> game could be a legacy game if you have a Sharpie. <laughs> Holy cow, this car does not want to cooperate with me. You talk to Ray, he's the construction guy. Here, set it down. I'll help you. So, what if each of these meeples are like the village people? Village meeples? The village meeples. All right. So I played that one there. So I, and I've got to play this one here, which is Good. okay. Because let's get this one out of the city. Like get out of the city. And then I'll go ahead. How many cards are left here? Four. Okay. This guy, so I'll go ahead right and here. this guy right here. Leave him alone. <laughs> You hear that protective order on this one? Secret Service uh, says do uh, not touch. So, so yeah. Ken's gone out of the construction business and out of the engineering business into the police business. There you go. Actually, you sound uh, a lot like Big Al Mansky right yeah, there. Yeah, right? Into the protection business. I think. Leave that guy alone. I'm yeah. going to take care He's of all myself. Paid up. <laughs> what was all right. that? Who's throwing cards? Apparently, I was. <laughs> all right, Andy. Okay. One mm. card left in the deck, huh? One card. I don't know if I'm going to get another turn, you guys. <laughs> God, I hope no, so. That, this is the point at which, Reese, you should say, I'm pretty sure I've got two or three more turns in me. <laughs> yeah. We, got, we can go around again. <laughs> so now she's not piled That's 18. That's a new turns. catchphrase for me. Usually my catchphrase is, this game has a lot of strategy in it. Yes. So, you know, I'm expanding. Ooh, okay. I'm on a boat. And, and I got a play. There we go. Nice. Okay, okay. okay. Good. You know, this guy over here is like, I wish I lived in a different suburb. <laughs> <laughs> they're still building the ferry route. Yeah. You can see them building the boat. They're, they're, they're still digging a canal to put water in over here. And he's like, man, they started this at 5 p.m. And that <laughs> like those is... old cartoons where they're digging and putting down the track as yes, they go. right in front of it. All right, so Andy, you're done. Well, I can take a lemon card and I can help. All right, all them. right, all right. Um, and I thank you, Matthew McConaughey. I'm going to. <laughs> uh, I'm going to send that? this guy home. Nice. And I will go ahead. Half the people and... are home. Uh oh, that there. He's and emptying the hand. I will do this to extend that route, and then my hand is empty, and I am done, and I cannot right. draw. Probably gonna get. Well, I'll this probably get six more turns. This guy's walking. All right. Good. good. That's what? a good. I'm move. so surprised. This guy. <laughs> I thought you were gonna discard that card. I was like, "What are you doing?" <laughs> And no, then... discard. That's the null symbol. You can't discard that. Oh, there you go. All right. Oh, let's see. I have to play. Hold on. Before I play this one, <laughs> I have to play this one. Oh, okay. That's fine. So now I yeah. can play this. The designer said it's okay. Yes. All right. Our our rule is if you show a card, you play it. You yeah. have to play it. So it's okay if, if you have to do a little thinking, but if you show it, you can't put it back in your hand. And he's home. Yeah. Okay. And I'm done. 
So we have to cap. Two thirds of the people are home. Move, we move. Cap a, cap a bus route, have to cap a train route, and get people home. We Risa? Oh, I'm not. Okay. Uh oh. Okay. 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 Uh, well, I think that's I an old commercial, right? Cap, cap, move, move. <laughs> <laughs> I do not have really anything that can be helpful. So what I'm gonna do is that. Play two cards, that's all you have to do. Yeah, all I gotta do is play two cards. So I can do that. And remember, if if you were to put a another station of the type and uh -huh. then have a card that moves them along to that last station, yeah. then they could walk or take the vehicle back to the suburb if it gets played next. So sometimes that, it's you know, it to have that out there. It's nice to have that option sometimes. Another hot tip. Well, <laughs> then let's do that hot tip. And let's do that. That's my you turn. You played two cards. I played my two cards. I will hold on to my other two cards. They are not helpful. Ray. Okay. And just in case I get another turn. Yeah, which would require Chris. Yeah, not getting another turn. It's coming down to the wire, folks. That's yeah, very much so. Okay. Don't that change that, that dial. <laughs> Ray. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just A trying lot to... will depend on this turn right now. <laughs> so. No pressure. I got this guy. All right. That's okay. good. That's a good thing. Where's the other bus cap? I wonder. <laughs> <laughs> That's a question no. for, for uh, Steve Rogers. Where's the other bus right. cap? <laughs> <laughs> So Ooh. that is my two, guys. Oh, 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 oh man. Cap? Oh, good lord. Okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Well, the good news is okay. we can get this right. man home. That first, that's, so five of the six. Awesome. Nicely done. Bing. Now, I also have to play this card, okay. which is OK. Because oh, I can oh get God. them. Oh, yes. 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 Okay. So now the question is, can I do anything helpful with these two cards? Uh, and yes. I will. I will give an example of helpful. what Chris was talking nope. about earlier. Don't you're, play you're, it. No. No. Chris. You have. Oh. Because now I can play this card oh. and get this guy down the route a little bit further. Okay. You just about gave us a heart attack. <laughs> yeah. well, what? All right. All right. It's all up to Andy. Okay. <laughs> so. This is it. This is the last turn of the game, no matter what. This is you it. The cap. Okay. And now. Now, is it a bus? Is it a walk? I Here's my prediction oh, before Andy plays. I'm pretty sure he's got the bus, but he didn't have another walk and wanted to murder you. <laughs> That's correct. <laughs> <laughs> Victory. Oh my gosh. Two, Two in a row. row. Two in a row. I, Woo! I'm going to the boat. <laughs> I don't I don't know. I'm sure Chris and Kevin have played this game more times than they can count, but I'm I'm pretty close to that too, and I have never won two times in a row. I, I'm I can count one. pretty high, you know. Well, <laughs> I will I will put it this way: we did play basically three games yesterday, mm -hmm. and now we're playing a couple. And this is what I will say: the more you play with people, the more in sync you get before you say bye 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 and go your separate ways and then you lose it all and then you come back together and you lose a bunch of times but it's true you you will yeah. play and you will lose and you will want to play again and again and again and then you will finally get that win now winning two times in a row yeah it doesn't happen all that often but it is nice and you do get that shorthand for what you're doing with people unless people like kev decide to pull stuff like put down a walk card at the end and everyone goes, <laughs> <laughs> yeah and that was i know what i'm doing <laughs> Got to build the tension for the people. <laughs> Let me just say, I am not the buying viewers. a house in this subdivision out here, man. It is, <laughs> it is murder. 
<laughs> yeah, the key <laughs> four <laughs> stop way out. Yeah, four bus key, stops so away from home. Out, let's take let's take a little uh we're gonna take an aerial view here of this whole thing so yes we had the big city and then we had to come all the way out here to get to this poor suburb out here so yeah this is uh quite quite a distance from the city so great work everybody yeah yeah nice that job great thank you so much for for joining us here uh everybody who who tuned in and watched uh, mass transit is um one to six players available in in late may and uh we had a, a blast playing it and we hope that you'll pick it up and play it with your friends and family too awesome thank you all so much for joining us uh check it out this is the last of our streams but there's still tons of stuff going on at the convention you can stop by our discord we're going to be demoing this game right after this so come stop by and play a game with us all right thank you all so much for joining us thank you thank you everybody thank you bye bye, -bye.